Hey YouTube. So first of all, I'm gonna thank everybody who's been watching these YouTube videos that I've been making about jewelry. I randomly just started making jewelry for fun and it's totally turned into something bigger than I ever expected. Like people are really starting to recognize my jewelry just like when I'm out on the street and people are asking me, oh, where'd you get those earrings or, you know, and I'm like, oh, I made them. They're like, nah, -uh, really? So this is my first YouTube video really about my jewelry because I'm going to start a website soon and try and, you know, start selling it for real. I mean, I make stuff for people here and there, but I really don't have so much a full like business about it. So this is basically going to be the jump start of everything. These are the Basketball Wives inspired earrings that I that everyone seems to be like into and I also have a pair in my ear if you guys can see them. These beads are so freaking pretty. Um I'm going to start selling these. Yes, I did make them as well as the feathered earrings and all the other videos that I've started and you know, I have to say, I've seen them online and on other websites and stuff. And you can even go on Dolce, I think it's Evelyn's website, and they're like $90. That's a little expensive. If you don't want to pay that, you can make these earrings. You don't have to, like, spend a gazillion dollars on a pair of earrings that aren't even real. That aren't even, like, real gold or, you know, just, it's kind of ridiculous. So, basically, you can do it yourself. And I'm all about do it yourself. If you can find a way to get around something, like a cheaper way to do things, it's very simple. Like, just go and buy the beads and buy a hoop earring and make sure it's thin. And you can just slide them right on. It's that simple. It is not rocket science. Do not go out and spend $9 on pair of earrings. I mean, it, I wouldn't spend over 20 30 bucks on these. No more than that. That's just insane. So, if you can't make them yourself you can always hit me up and I can make them for you or you can just go find the beads yourself or order the beads online and all the pieces and stuff you need but I mean that's a little extra to do that just to make one pair of earrings unless you're gonna make a few so it's easier kind of sometimes to buy them from someone but to spend a lot whole lot of money on them is not worth it um, also I've been working on other pairs of feathered earrings so I decided to add them to this video as well. And I mean, these are like black and yellow. I don't know why I was inspired by the song, so I decided to make a pair of black and yellow earrings. It's hilarious. But if you're, um, if you like these colors, here they are. They're very full. I tend to make my feathered earrings full. I don't like thin feathered earrings. And mine are always very, really long. I mean, I can make short ones, but I don't like to. But if someone ordered a pair of short ones, of course I'd make them, but I normally just make them long. And I also added, like, different things to these earrings than I have to my other ones. I've put, be like, little yellow rhinestones on them. I mean, they're really cool, like, when you wear them on your ear. They're very full. They're just as long as your hair. I mean, it depends on what you like. I mean, I don't know how often people wear black and yellow, but these were just you know colors that I had I have so many different color feathers and I said to myself like oh I've never put these two colors together so why not so that's one here's the other one for the other ear like I said they're really full they have like little rhinestones and I mean I know people you can go out and just buy feather earrings now because it seems like everyone's really selling them now they're really out there but I mean like if you want some handmade and they're one of a kind you can always like hit me up and I can get on that for you. Also here are the yellow and gold ones or yellow and white actually. I'm going to find gold feathers to add to this. And I added little heart charms, wait I don't know if that's in the camera, to these and it starts off with a nice little heart charm. And here's the other one. It's really, really cute, cute, cute earrings. I absolutely love them. So, oh, and also, I'm getting into just making random things now. Here is a cheetah print watch. This is really easy to do. You can just go buy a plain gold watch and you can all you do is just like this one was made um I actually bought this I didn't make this one 
but I looked at it and it's really easy to make so I'm gonna start making watches too very soon um, all you need to do is just go buy the little rhinestones yourself you can use a hot I would use a hot glue gun I guess I don't know we'll find out when I start making them <laughs> and you just glue the rhinestones on the watch you know I'm all about bedazzling everything so I'm very gaudy so I love jewelry and I'm a girly girl like a, a true 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 girly girl so that's basically why all my jewelry is so shiny and blinged out and stuff like that that's just my personality but I mean like if you guys are interested in you know getting earrings just hit me up you can Facebook me email me what have you whatever you feel like doing also, I wanted to show you guys these new pair of shoes I got. How nice are these? My bestie sent these to me from California. Love these. Love having friends in other places because it's so much easier. Alright, so that's basically what this video is about. I'm going to be making a video very soon about clothes. That's my next thing. I don't make clothes or anything like that, but I love putting pieces together. I think I'm going to start, like, on the website that the jewelry is going to be on. I'm going to start, like, a fashion blog and have all these different, like, pieces that I put together and clothes. And because I also get a lot of compliments on what I wear. So, if you guys stay tuned for that. And just keep watching my videos. Thank you so much for your support. And basically, just subscribe to my page. You're missing out. Thanks, guys. Bye.